data shows today that um, African Americans give up about 25% of their income for giving and, and giving in one form or fashion. That's been a way of life for a long time. My name is Lonnie Irvin. The name of our business is eFusion Solutions. It is a nonprofit located in Raleigh. We've been in existence for about eight years, and our mission and vision entails working with at risk youth and young adults, providing the nutritional and educational opportunities that they might not otherwise have an opportunity to be exposed to. eFusion came to us as a passion of wanting to give back. Um, and some of those folks that that inspired me. One in particular that stands out, her name is Georgia Gilmore, and it comes back to for philanthropic type giving. Having worked in the institutions of education for a long time, seeing kids come to school without technology that's gonna allow them to be competitive, it's just un unbelievable. So from there, we created one of our legacy products and programs called Project Reach, where we refurbish uh, technology to make sure that kids have those. We have quite a few legacy products, and one that the church actually participated in um, is a, a Fostering Love, which is a program where we create foster, uh, backpacks and bags for uh, children that may be in foster care, uh, which we're taking that project on, and we've gotten some sponsors, and we're trudging on, uh, on doing that again this year. Black history to me is very important and it means so much to know that I can contribute and, and, and that we can contribute and that we have contributed to the success of this nation as well as other nations around the, around the world. It's very important that we share it um, because our history is not just our history. Our history is everybody's history. So I, I think that it's really important that uh, we do that and not only in just one month, but it should be a 365 effort. Dig. Get out there and find out there's a lot of history about you and about what your contributions have been to society.